Hey guys, I wanted to do a quick video. Um, I got, right now I got the uh, VCMI hooked up to the car through OBD2. Channel one and two being used for can high, can low. And up top I have the USB going right into the top of the Ultra here. So I wanted to show you that you can use this and use bi-directional controls and do anything you want with the scope as well. I'm just using the, the breakout box to make things easier, but I'm hooked up to can high, can low. The beeping is uh, my voltage here. So, and then I'm going to the car OBD2 port for this, okay? So my two channels are hooked up here. And then, like I said, I got my can high, can low signal right here. Bi-directional tests while the scope's running. So uh, we're gonna go test with uh, 10 Hertz right now. We're gonna activate that. I don't know if you can hear that. Deactivate, escape. We're gonna go with uh, this tone. Okay, we're gonna deactivate, escape, thousand. Deactivate, escape. Okay, we're gonna go back in, we're gonna go out. Um, we're gonna go back out again. And we're gonna go into topology and we're gonna rescan again. So you can scan, you can do bi-directional controlling, and you can have the scope at the same time running. So there you go. Um, so you can have everything running at the same time. You can do whatever you want. The scope is all independent. Uh, has nothing to do with the scanner part of it. You can see my voltage at 11.9. So and we can pretty much enter, uh, you know, any anything we want still get in on the trouble codes all right so this is the lin component of it so we're gonna escape out of here we're gonna go into um Electric fan, activate, not running. Okay, we gotta be at a certain uh, temperature here. Yeah, so I mean, it looks like it's all here. I don't see really anything missing, you know, or anything I can't do. I'm going to the ABS. Let's see what's over here. Yeah, pump motor, I guess. Yeah. So you can hear that activating. Escape out of here. So yeah, that's it. Um, again, you can get in there. Then uh, if you want, you can just click that over and the scope goes away. Or you can click it back the other way. Uh, you can open the scope back up again. You can, I believe you can shift these around too. I haven't really played around with it yet. Um, I know you can open four, four screens all together, at least. I haven't really figured that part out yet. So that's it guys. Nice short video. I appreciate you watching and have a good night.